So streamer Forsen has been indefinitely banned for showing accidental nudity. Apparently it was a horse gif that was inappropriate. I, I don't know which one it is, but <laughs> let's try to look for it. All right, so I can't show you because it's actually animal porn. <laughs> so it's a real horse getting his wiener sucked by a female. So he was accidentally, he was baited into clicking it. So it's bestiality if uh, the image I saw is true. So that's why he was banned. It's an accident. It's accidental porn. So he saw it for like one second and then uh, he closed down the window. And yeah, he knew that he was gonna get banned. It's uh, absolutely ridiculous. If streaming is your livelihood, which I think you should diversify because it's so goddamn risky. YouTube is pretty risky, but it's less risky than Twitch because they hand out bans as if it's nothing. Two males, of course, to females. Uh, a lot of females get away with a lot of shit that males don't get away with because there's a whole bunch of simps working for Twitch, apparently. I don't know, I'm just assuming. Regardless, it's a black and white enforcement for some creators and for others, they just turn a blind eye and that's the problem. So this other streamer here, Casey Tron, who was a uh, Leagues of Legend player. By the way, if you don't know Forsen, Forsen is a Hearthstone player. So anyway, she went on a rant on stream. Apparently she's someone who experienced an indefinite suspension on the platform earlier this year when she was banned for hateful conduct after making a joke about a global crisis. So what was that? All right, so apparently it was an offensive joke where she said that she would spread coronavirus if she could because the world would be better without all that poor people. Jesus Christ. So she's a troll. I mean, you see this is a Pornhub logo. It was a joke. She's a troll and uh, she got banned. Engaging in a hateful conduct and threats of violence against a person or group of people. Context matters and on YouTube at least they take that into consideration before handing you a strike. But when they review it at least context matters. A joke is a joke. It's not actually encouraging violence against people, but with Twitch, unless you're a hot female, not that, not that she's ugly, but she's not a hot female, then you're gonna get banned if you say something against their terms of service and it's black and white. So yeah, uh, let's see the rant that uh, she gave. Has been banned for over two weeks now because he accidentally showed nudity. Imagine. I'm not even like a force and fan or a force and simp or anything, but just to like basically give the troll viewer what they wanted, and hurt somebody financially like that for accidentally showing nudity because they were given a gift that they didn't, you know? It's just like, Twitch just makes some of the stupidest fucking decisions ever. And that's why as soon as the DMCA shit started happening, I was like, a lot of streamers, they were like, oh, I'm gonna take the time, go through Thank all of my clips, you, you know, make sure I get them saved. I was row. like, nope, I'm fucking nuking everything now. I do not trust these motherfuckers Lana with my livelihood. They subscribe. never, it's my ever asterisk, make a good asterisk, call, asterisk, asterisk. ever. Oh yeah, that's uh, pretty much it. That's your, uh, the Force and Ben Explained and KC Tron's comments. All right, guys, like, comment, subscribe, peace.